Okay, Jake Donovan, BoxingScene.com, here with the WBC lightweight champ, David Diaz. David, congratulations on tonight's fight. Uh, talk about your performance. Well, it was a rough fight. We knew we were going to go for a war. Uh, I told everybody was, when uh, we had the first press conference here in Chicago that it was going to be a war, and he wasn't going to go with uh, the fourth title. I told him that, and um, thank God everything came out all right, and we had to press in the second half of the fight, and we, and we did it. Okay. Uh, I know you said you were preparing for a war. Were you surprised that Morales kind of showed flashes of uh, the old era? Morales? Yeah, I, I told everybody that uh, five pounds is five pounds. Um, he had, uh, you know, five pounds from what he had before, and, and he did a good job. He came out strong in the first half, but in the second half, we, we just knew we had to put the pressure, and, uh, and we did okay. okay. What was going through your mind after the first knockdown? I know you said it was a flash knockdown, but... No, no, it was it was a nice little crisp punch, I mean, and... Um, but it, um, it wasn't where I was like dazed or anything. Right. It was just, that's why I considered a flash night up because I got up and I was ready to go. And um, I think I lost that round 10-9 instead of 10-8. Right, I agree. Did it frustrate you that you won two minutes and 30 seconds in a round and then just that one trip to the canvas just yeah. pushed it around? Yeah, it did, it did. I was like, man, no, it was my fault. I left my chin out there and uh, it's a pretty big chin and, you know, got, <laughs> got hit. So, hey, you got to deal with it. All right, okay, you came back in the second. I thought everybody in the arena had you winning that. Third through the sixth was kind of difficult. What happened in the fight that uh, had you falling behind? Um... His jab, his jab, his jab was was real good, a lot um, crispier than I than I thought it would be, and um, that that was the difference in the third through the sixth round. But then in the seventh round, he just started like gassing, okay. so we just picked it up and, and, and we won. Okay, they say two heads are better than one. Bringing in Kevin Cunningham for this uh, fight, how advent oh, it was advantageous great. was it for you? He was screaming at me for a little <laughs> bit and um, got me fired up, and and we did a good job. I also like to say that uh, my camp here in Chicago, we started training since January right. for this fight. So there's everybody here in Chicago um, <laughs> deserves this victory because um, it was all a team effort. Okay. Okay. I know during the promotion you said you really didn't care that a lot of it was geared toward Morales. Um, you said as long as you know they just respect you after you won the fight. Do you feel like you earned that respect? I hope I did. Okay. I, I think I did. I did what I had to do to win. and. Um, um, the judges seen the fight the way they seen it. Um, one one judge had it, uh, a draw, and the other two had it for me. Okay. And um, I thought it was a close fight, but I, I figured that I pulled it out at the end. Okay. Did it frustrate you that Morales just kind of just interrupted you at it's, the end? It's, it's, it's your it's, moment, and he came across. It's 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 part of a, a, um, the person who lost. Mm -hmm. It's the frustration. Hey, whatever. If he if he wanted to get it on up there, I, I, that's why I stepped back a little <laughs> because right. I figured maybe he's going to try to swing. No doubt. And. We just, uh, I just had to answer back to him because I, I, there's no way, there's not an ounce of dirtiness in me. Mm -hmm. I, I go out there and fight and um, try to give the fans everything they, they, they want to see, and I think I did that. Okay, where do you believe you rank in the lightweight division? Uh, we got uh, right now, I, I, I'll stay at 2-1. Yeah, 1, why not? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, a reputation unfair or otherwise is that you're the weakest of the three Diaz's in the division. I know Let's you want to get the ring and then find out, man. Okay. I mean, I mean, I, I get up for the fights. I mean, that's just me. I mean, you seen this fight? They said that Morales was going to beat me down and all this, right. and I got up for it. I got in his face and just had to do what we had to do to win. Um, if I'm the weaker of the Diaz, then fine. Let's prove it. <laughs> right. Let's prove it. That's all I'm saying. Right. Okay. Even with the win, obviously, you know, with the eye, you took a little bit of punishment tonight. Are you done for 2007? Um, I don't know. Are we done? 2007? No, I don't know. I don't know. If something comes up nice, if, if something comes up nice, then, then we're ready to rock because I'm 31, man. I ain't 22. So um, we'll, we'll get down if we have to. Okay. Uh, the other two DSs, they're fighting in October. I guess that was the question I was looking for. Are you going to hold out and wait for the winner of that, or would you like to fight someone in between? No, I, I, I'll hold out and see, see what happens. I have a good time right now with my wife and my kids. Okay. Enjoy them for for about two days and then get rid of them <laughs> and, and then, <laughs> and, then um, and then go out on a trip by myself and have fun okay all right man no doubt thanks